Hey everybody, it's time once again for the Mythwits, and this is a special night. This is one of our best shows of the year. This is the Movie Draft. And as you all know, this is the show dedicated to all things geek pop culture, drenched in absurdity, and coated with sarcasm. Every week we bring on an industry guest, or three, uh, to talk about the ever-expanding Geekoverse. We do our damnedest to be funny, but there are no guarantees. I'm your host, Peter Bryant, and joining me on this episode is my co-host, the uh, fruiting body-like appendage, Mike Kafis. <laughs> Good evening. <laughs> and on this episode, I am delighted to bring uh, three wonderful guests in. I'm going to start with uh, Scott Sigler. Hey, Scott. What's up? How are you? His partner in crime, A. Kovacs. Howdy. And our, our, our many multiple returning guest, Violet Lavoie. If you watch the show at all, you know Lavoie. Yeah. Like Lavoie. So, exactly. <laughs> so we have, oh man, we got this. This show is going to be crazy. The draft is awesome. Everybody's all queued up. But before we get started, um, I'm going to let I'm going to let my co my my go uh, my guests, not my co-host, my guests, uh, introduce themselves. A uh, little elevator pitch on who they are and what they do. I'll start. Uh, let's go with Violet first. Hey, my name is Violet Lavoie, and I'm a film critic. Uh, I've appeared in RogerEbert.com, Men's Health, that kind of thing. I'm also a novelist. Um, my most recent book is called Scarstruck, but I'm most famous for the book entitled I'll Fuck Anything That Moves and Stephen Hawking. So nice to meet you. <laughs> and we'll, we'll stay with the ladies first category. <laughs> hey, Because that's going to be easy to follow. Yeah. <laughs> My name is A.B. Kovacs. I am the director of Doom at Empty Set Entertainment. We publish Scott Sigler's books that he doesn't write for the big five publishers and um, sell T-shirts, stickers, all sorts of stuff. And once a year, we do something called Sigler Fest, where we get about 150 fans and friends together, and we spend the whole weekend hanging out in Vegas. Oh, We're Pete, coming this year. If there was some way that we could get there and, and be involved and maybe do our show there. If only there you was could. some way we could do that. I know a girl. Let's you talk know. after the show. I know. I do you know, know a real girl that would help us with that? At least one. At least one. <laughs> yeah. And All speaking right. of Sigler, Scott Sigler. Yes. Uh, hello. I'm Scott Sigler. I am an author. I am I have a library of many leather-bound books, some of which I actually wrote. I'm horribly important and terribly busy, and I'm ready to bid on these movies, bro. The all right. Bros and broettes. <laughs> all right. We're all bros here. All right. Yeah. So, so Mike, why don't you explain? Uh, why don't you explain the rules? Uh, I could do that. Uh, let me pull the draft wrapper. I, I was just looking at the chat room for a second, but uh, yeah, Peter, I'll do you have? We'll do you have the? Do um, much in the chat room. Yeah, unfortunately. Okay. But do you have? Are, are, can you show us the uh, draft raptor page? Sure can. Here you go, everybody. There you okay. Go. So everyone, um, this is what Pete is going to be showing. I'm hearing myself a little bit shadowed. Uh, that's a little weird, but anyway, um, Pete can. Um, I'm sorry. Okay, it went away. <laughs> that was really weird. So this is the draft raptor, and basically everyone here is going to be bidding on movies. Everyone here has 100. Um, units or uh, Pete, what are they called? Quatloos. Oh, they're called Quatloos. That's right. I thought maybe you decided to change the name. Okay, no. so we're going to have everyone has 100 Quatloos. Uh, you can see everyone's name here at the bottom, um, and you can see the slate of movies. Uh, uh, we have 25, and um, I will start a particular bid. There will be a three second countdown, and then we will commence the bidding. Um, each, each movie, uh, we will have 10 seconds of. Um, bidding down the um, there'll be a 10 second countdown for each movie and then um, whoever gets it it goes onto their slate at the bottom you'll see with uh, all, everyone's names Violet's, uh, Peter's, A's, Scott's and myself and and Mike they can still they get to see this in the window where we are you know they get to see yes. it with, in our window or uh, there's a link right in the notes for this if you go up you scroll up to the notes because Scott asked if there was a link the the, the right in the notes of this video uh, in our in our Facebook Live, there's a link you can click on. You can watch this live. You can watch this bid live and everything. Yes, it is. There it is. It is yeah, uh, draftraptor.mw. Dash uh, a bunch of stuff there. Yes. Right. <laughs> so just so, click on that. That'll take you to it. Yeah. If you guys um, ever want, to, if you guys want to go jump in and out of the chat room, you're more than welcome to. But uh, 
please feel free to play along at home. Um, yeah, hey, hey, Scott, if they if they just go to Facebook, uh, if they go to uh, forward slash Mythwits, it'll take the live videos right there. I think that the actual link, slash. just forward slash Mythwits. Got it, I think. All right, there, cool, cool. All right, they'll be able to find it. Mm-hmm. All right, so... So, so Mike, this uh, th- how does this work? We're gonna how we, we're gonna bet we're gonna bet these quat lose, right? Uh, we got a few seconds. Yes, everyone. Um, I, I, yeah, I said that. Yeah, everyone has say, ten sorry, seconds. I'm sorry, I was distracted. Pardon me. <laughs> well, everyone Pardon will have me. ten seconds to count down. We are uh, all all of the um, all of the our contestants have already ran through. We we they all have a better understand. They have all of a the right, rudimentary there. understanding of how this is gonna work. So, um, what uh, what are we? I'm hearing something. Is somebody having something playing in the background? Who, who's who's oh. the guilty party? Not me, man. Nothing up here. Rock and roll. No, nothing, nothing up here. Okay. Nothing here. <laughs> hey, hey, oh, Scott, uh, this is for you. I forgot to play this for you. This for you. Hey, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Danny Lundy. All right. Okay. So, uh, Pete, uh, as we, we did tell everyone that we are drawing – um, each movie from a hat. So uh, you've got your hat, and yep. we'll uh, draw for the first movie. All right, here we go. Let's get it on. Oh boy, big one right out the gate. Toy uh, Story shit. Four. Ooh, let me look here at my. Uh, look here, we got. So Toy Story Four. I swear to God that I thought that they promised they weren't going to make another one of these after three. Are you sure that's not Toy Story Three? They're just putting out again. No man, they they talked about this a couple of years back. These are these are going to be. Uh, I think her name was Bonnie. I think it's going to be Bonnie's uh, toys when Andy uh, passed them on. Oh fun! I have a, ch- I have a child, you see. <laughs> yeah, she was a big so, Toy Story fan. I mean, I thought right. the trailer was encouraging. So yeah, for what it's worth. Yeah. All right, you guys uh, ready? Yeah, yep. ready to roll. Let's do this. All right, uh, Violet up with 15, I'm going 20. And Anybody if you, else? if you. Oh, yeah. so you can keep bidding? Yeah, 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 yeah you, you can keep, keep bidding. bidding. Oh. Well, it's ended, okay. All right, well, there we go. There we go, shit. First movie's bought by me, 20 bucks, or 20, oh, oh not bucks. Uh-oh. I'll lose. <laughs> All right, so now as you'll okay. see, I will confirm that. And now you'll see that Pete now owns that movie. It is in his slate. Uh, Got it. And if you'll see, if you bet 20 before Pete bet 20, or if you mm-hmm. bet after Pete bet 20, that is, uh, your well, yours will be rejected because mm-hmm. he went first. That's what okay. happened to me. And I was thinking, oh, I got that. But that, I'm Mr. Blue. I'm not Mr. Green. So. <laughs> right. All right. All right. All right, Mike. Ready? I think that was a deal. I think I got a steal on that one. I think you did. All right. Went big. Next Put down one. 20 quaaludes on that. That was a lot of quaaludes. That's a lot of quaaludes. <laughs> a lot of quaaludes. <laughs> it's a little funny after that one. All right. Yeah. Jesus. Detective Pikachu. Yeah. Ooh. That's another big one. Ooh. Detective Pikachu. All right. Uh, I'm ready to go. What are, Does anyone have anything they want to say about this one before we get started? Ryan Reynolds. Hello. Hello. You don't get to see his yeah. face, man. Doesn't matter. Yeah, it, You're good to hear his yeah. back. I was yeah, I was a little confused why Pikachu sounded like Deadpool. Threw <laughs> <laughs> me for a bit. I, you, I you know like that. Yeah. You know that user cut is coming soon. They're just going to take Deadpool lines and put them over Pikachu. It should be great. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> that's that's Perfect. what I'm going to my. Perfect. That's what I'm going to spend my quat lose on for sure. Right. But All you right. know what's, right, what's going to be interesting about this one is you got the kids that like the Pikachu and you got the adults now that grew right. up with the Pokemon and the yep. Pikachu who are like dying a, to and take And then you have adults that never never Pokemon until last year. Really? So oh, wow. Yeah. And how do you feel nice. about the Pikachu? Uh, I'm. How do you feel about him being a detective? Uh, we'll take your answer uh, while we're bidding. Here we go. <laughs> All, right. All right. Oops. Put the draft rafter back up. Okay. It opens with seven and 23 by A. Kovacs. Mm-hmm. Oh, nice. back at 27. oh, we got a contest going on here. Yes. Seven. Eat. Oh, A. Kovacs. Eat. Oh, 30 <laughs> 
Oh, Damn Kovacs, it. 33. Nope. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the Ryan oh, Reynolds factor is strong. Very strong. It's just because it's one of the only movies I'll be sure to see this summer. <laughs> okay. Right. Yeah. Congratulations, A, with your first movie, Detective Pikachu. All right, Peter. Okay, next movie. And as you can see, you can see how many uh, Quatlus uh, everyone has left uh, now after uh, bidding on two of 25 movies. Remember, yep. 25 movies. One movie... It's not going to win you the draft. So this is crazy, Mike. You know, last year when we did this draft, uh, it was like yes, every everything like, crappy came at the movie. End. Yeah. Uh -huh. Pet Cemetery. Is that the new one? Oh. Pet Cemetery. Yeah, All right. Yeah. Pet Cemetery. yeah, the new one. Yeah. I don't want to be buried in a pet cemetery. I might as well not bother bidding on this one. It's not going to happen. Yeah. For you. Yeah. It's not going to happen. Are you smack talking? Uh -oh. <laughs> oh, oh, wait a minute. Because, you know, you know how I go, Pete. When I know oh, somebody I wants a movie, I, I, I shit bid. Yeah, yeah. Right. You get stuck with a lot of shit bids, too. I, I sure do. Let's see every what happens. Year. Every now. Year. All right, let's do it, Mike. Oh, it was 18. A Kovacs. Oh. Bold bid, Kovacs. Bold, bold, bold. Mm. 18. Going, going gone. Totally hey, Comax gets Pet Ooh. Cemetery. I don't know. I'm just going to play Pokemon for like after I spend all my quat loons, I guess. <laughs> <You're>, <laughs> or maybe just gonna, smack talk all of you guys. You're going to play Pokemon in a Pet Cemetery is what you're going to do. Right. True. True. Pokemon I definitely Pokemon. need Deadpool with me to do that. Yes. All right. All right. Let's burn this out. Let's, let's get a crappy movie, crappy movie. No whammies. <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, good. All right, wish granted. Curse of La. Is it? Is it? Is it two L's? Is La Llorona. Right? Yeah, like, La like, Llorona. Well, not like Llama, I guess, but you know, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, uh, like my Sharona. Do do yeah, do do, do do Yeah, La Llorona. All right. Ooh, she make my motor run, motor run. <laughs> now this one, I just Great horror. I, yeah, it is it's horror. A, it's a horror movie. It is. Mm -hmm. Aye. All right, Mike. Let's do this. All right. Uh, All right. Knock it out. Where is, where is that? Where is that one? Ooh. There it is. That's the first one. Curse of. Yep. All right. Here we go. All right. Three. All right. Mm. It's going for three for Scott. Thinking that that might be. <laughs> The high and only yes, <laughs> Scott oh, wins. Curse of my Sharona. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I, I didn't want it First for four. First to my list. Yeah, I really just did not want it for four. All yeah, right, I felt the same go. way. Yeah. Welcome to your first movie. Nice. How does it feel? It feels good. It's got Linda Cardellini in it and Raymond Cruz, Marissa Ramirez. We know these are some big names at the box office, you guys. Linda Carter was in Madness. She played Velma. She's been in a lot of things. No, yeah. she's great. She's got a cult following. She just can't put butts in the seats like, uh, you know, who, who I like, Amber Heard or somebody. Like yeah. Pikachu. Yeah, yeah exactly. Like yeah. <laughs> uh, that's Detective Pikachu. All right, right. The next one is Secret, of, Secret Life of Pets 2. Oh. The yeah. Secret Life of Pets 2. Didn't see Scott, the first are you going one. in for this one? Oh, yeah. I'm, uh, I'm going to get it for four. <laughs> are you? Ooh. Well, let's see how that works out for you. For you. Let's see how that works out for you. I'll go in for you. Wow, 14. Oh. Um. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. That's uh, too rich for my blood. So we got Scott at 15. I took it for 20. Oh, Violet's 23. Oh, oh God. Oh, 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 the first one did pretty good. Um, <laughs> oh, no. Peter. I don't know. I feel I feel good about this movie. <laughs> God damn it. Violet did 26. I just, I just, oh, Peter. You have to take the kids to go look at something for two hours. <laughs> right. Oh, but the first one did so good. Oh, damn it. All right. Violet wins it for 26. All right. Wow. 26. Oh, I love Violet, it. Violet, I think, I honestly, it. 
we're gonna, that's going to turn out to be a great buy. I guarantee you. That's you know, a good buy. I really do. I, I just, you know, people like the first one. It's the Minions people. They have a good brand built in. They'll go see right. it. And the kids need to see something. They need to take exactly. They got to look at something. something. Right. <laughs> right. And with five movies off the slate, Peter, gonna, what is our sixth movie? Sixth movie. A Dog's Journey. Okay, I got to pipe up about this one, okay? This okay. was supposed to be released in 2017 as A Dog's Purpose, but <laughs> oh. it got bad internet buzz that there was uh, animal abuse on set. And so I think what they did was, it, it nothing was really proven. If somebody had shot a video that ended up on TMZ of a dog not wanting to go into, like, some water on a stunt or something. Um, right. I think it was, but it was bad enough news that they shelved it for two years and now they're bringing it back under another title and i think the trailer is cut differently too if i remember so they're oh. they're trying to sweep it under the rug a little bit well i don't know how much they could sweep under the rug because the trailer was basically the movie i mean right like all <laughs> oh, they needed to do yeah. was roll the credits on the trailer yeah. <laughs> so, so this isn't a sequel i thought this was a sequel to a dog's journey no. they actually no oh, no shit. yeah it's just it's it's the we kind of hoped you would forget we made this movie that people said we heard animals on by the way would you like this new one it worked but i don't I i'd also like to say this shut up i didn't cry when i watched the trailer right. you cried <laughs> you cried <laughs> Yeah, I, cry. I, was pissed. I don't have a dog that can jump off my back and catch a frisbee. I was like, I'm, I'm, just, my dog. I'm just allergic to dogs. And I'm like, why don't you do stuff like this, you dummy? That's what I do. <laughs> oh. This just in Scott Sigler mistreating his dogs. <laughs> I mean, that only talking about that movie. So. <laughs> this one right, right. here. This oh. one right here needs to jump up and catch frisbees and shit. Right here. Uh. <laughs> well, Hi, recipe. Maybe small frisbees. Say hi, Reese. Hello, how are you? Hello, uh, everybody. Hello. <laughs> Dog Hello. of Doom. Put it back on her desk, bed. That's like a miniature version of mine. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, that my, of uh, 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 Bella. Looks like a miniature yeah, version of Bella. All right. Um, we're going to start this journey. We're going to see uh, how right. how low this, this movie can go for. <laughs> how low can you go? All right, nobody's bidding yet. Oh, there we go. Two, four. Oh, okay. wow. All right, all right. Damn. I decided it was worth four. <laughs> Pete gets it for five. <laughs> Not over yet. Not over yet. Uh oh. oh. A code oh. Goes six. It's dogs. They had to bid on it because it's dogs. A with the canine. Not gonna let a dog movie go. Not gonna happen. <laughs> oh, 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 Violet! Going to get it for ten. Violet's I getting this for ten. On she thinks this. <laughs> you think this movie is going to beat uh, the? Never mind. I'm not going to say it. Not going to say it. All right. So Violet got it for ten. Violet just scammed everyone with her made-up story about the movie. Right. <laughs> right. right. Now it's a crazy well like done. that. Well done. <laughs> Don't and I think that's the first movie we all put on too. Right. Yeah. So let me tell you how everybody involved in the Avengers is a pedophile. Right. <laughs> <laughs> as long as you're not banging Stephen Hawking, it's okay. Right. 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 <laughs> nice. Nice. All right. Mike. Shazam. Oh boy. You know, you know what? Before this goes, I, I want to say, look, I know it looks cheesy. I know, but God damn it. I loved big. And I want to see super big. <laughs> you want to see super big. Super big. Man. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, man. I mean, I think uh, I I think just because I don't expect it's going to do well at all, I think it's going to do great. And that scares me because <laughs> it just looks so bad. Yeah. What but, movie are we talking about? Uh, Shazam. Shazam. Oh. Shazam. But I, I think I, I like how you said it was big. It was big. That, that definitely yeah, that's is, what it sort of. But I also see, according to my notes, it's coming out the same week as Pet Cemetery. So whichever mm. you think is going to do better in that, that's this. This is yeah. what they're up against. Oh, in a week, okay. When spring break? Nobody's going to go see Shazam on spring break. Wait, they're they're too busy throwing up out? on each other. No, that's Shazam's not out. out. Somebody nope. saw it. I read somewhere that somebody saw it, but it's uh, not Maria Walter yet. saw it. Yeah, so she must have seen it in the same screening. But yeah, she must have. Yeah. Yeah, Shazam, Shazam is not out until April 5th? 
Yeah. Fifth. Yeah. Fifth. Yeah. I, yeah. Dude, I checked because I heard somebody say that. I was like, oh, shit, do we have a movie that's already out? And I looked, and it's not out yet. So some people no. saw it in advanced oh, screens or something. John Lithgow. Wait a minute. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. I mean, yes, I love John Lithgow, but. Yeah. Right. Let's do it. Come on. Let's see how much you love you some John Lithgow. <laughs> because it's on. I'll oh, damn. To 10. Shit just jumped up a notch. Ooh, 19. Uh oh, he's oh. shit posting. Mike. All right, Mike, you're going to get it for 19. I'm going to let you have it for 19. Are you? <laughs> nice. Yeah. There you go. Suck us! Mike's on the board. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Mike. Yo. How's that bidding going for you? <laughs> I, I, I might have uh, hit the wrong button. I might have meant to go 12. <laughs> to be honest, I might have meant to go 12. I have written on my thing here that I think Shazam yeah. is going to make two hundred million, so I think you're going to be all right. Wow, wow! I, I might have meant to go twelve. That's my thought. So, uh, two hundred million. Plot loose. Yeah, I said one ninety one million. So yeah, That's pretty close. I don't know. Yeah, we'll see. Uh, Peter, oh, oh, what do we have movie. next? Yeah, we have a movie. All right, next movie. Next movie. The hustle. The hustle. The this hustle. Now like, I always. Um, this is a Amy Schumer. It's a remake of it's a remake of Dirty Rotten Scoundrels. Well, with, that's uh, not how, yeah. how well did uh, Dirty Rotten Scoundrels do? I mean, I remember well, that being kind of a cult it didn't movie. Kill it at the box office, but it's become right. a bit of a cult classic. So I think right, that's person. I think this one's gonna suffer from a little bit of the the gender swapping issue that's been going on. But Ocean's Eight did very well. Was very under the radar and made a shit ton of money. Right. So yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah, and it's about what the money. It's about the money, not the movie or anything yeah. else. And, and I'm sorry, it wasn't. It's Rebel Wilson. That's who it is. Rebel Wilson. Sorry. Yeah. And you don't you don't have that much time for to become a cult classic. So she's, we, she's we only funny. have a couple months. Right. Yeah. Rebel Wilson's pretty funny. All right, and uh, starting the hustle. Waiting on bids. Oh, Kovacs comes in for seven. Violet for fourteen. I should put this on. There we go, so people can see it. Uh, 14 going once. That's way above my budget for this one. And All sold. Right, Violet, Violet gets, gets it for 14. Violet, All I think right. you overspent on that one. You have a budget. You actually have a budget. What's that? You have a budget. I Yeah, it just got feeling. I just went down and wrote down numbers. <laughs> what I thought okay. it was going to make. <laughs> I, think, I think that one's going to make, I don't know, 5 million. I don't know, maybe 50 million. Maybe 50 million. Put it, I'll put uh, it at 65. It's going to do fine. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Oh, next movie. Yes. <laughs> what do you say there, bud? Ooh, Dark Phoenix. Dark Phoenix. The oh. next chapter in the X. The yeah. last chapter in the Fox X-Men franchise. Yeah. Mm. This is Fox's so you got to wonder how much money they're going to put into it now that they won't have it anymore. That's right. correct. Dark Phoenix. It could go two different <laughs> ways because they're still going to own it for its entirety, right? Because they produced it, so they still get it. Yeah, right. So yeah. they might try and go all out to get, but I haven't seen shit for it. I've seen like a very little for it, so I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know how they've done the a lot. The franchise has been dogging. It's not been doing yeah. very well. Right. Yeah. And they've been, they did a lot of they did a lot of reshoots on it, from what I understand. A That's lot always of a bad sign. That's always a yeah. bad sign. Yep. But speaking of which, oh, go ahead, go ahead. You no, know, speaking of reshoots, anybody heard anything about the New Mutants movie? Have they gotten that together or? Uh, no idea. No idea. No, no All right. Idea. So. New idea. All right. Let's All right. Do it, Mike. Here we go. Let's see how dark the Phoenix gets. Mm. Oh, ten. Uh -oh. Ten. Nice. That's Damn. Bid. God, I was opening with ten. Yeah. Oh, Violet goes eleven. Eleven. All right. It's got a 12. Oh. I have to watch these points here. I, I think Violet could get 12. it for 13. Yeah, I think Violet could go three. Oh, okay. Go oh. back 13. Oh, Scott's back at 14. <laughs> nice. Uh -oh. All right. We got a bidding war going on. You guys are getting at the edge of my blood. I don't know. Sigler has it for 14. Yep. Sigler's going to uh -oh. And he has it for 14. Nice. Nice. Well, 125 am... million, and you can take that to the bank, son. Yeah. 100. Bank. 125 million that you're happy about that yeah that would make it the poorest performing x-men movie of the franchise so 
So you got that I'm, going for you. I think it might be 150. <laughs> but it isn't uh, my Sharona, so no. there's that. Right. Not my Sharona. <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> Lee Iacocca. Lee Iacocca. Long shot. And this is not the X-Men. This is Right. Uh, <laughs> this is. Oh, it's not? Uh, no. Long no, shot. you know. Oh. This this is the one with uh, Seth Rogen, and it's like yep. his attempt at a first little rom com kind of a thing going mm-hmm. on. No, and... it's not his first attempt. No, no, he had that no. one with Katherine Heigl. Heigl, the one where knocked he up? like accidentally got her pregnant. Yeah, knocked up, knocked, knocked up. up. That's it. Yeah, yeah was he? In... Yeah. yeah, yeah. That was another who's story. His, of... uh, who's his co star in uh, Charlie, Charlie, Charlie Theron. Theron. Again? Wait, that's yes. not the same one. Never mind. My bad. My bad. Okay. Uh... All right. Let's do long shot, yep. Mike. All right, let's do it. Oh, Violet. Ooh. Violet's making a statement. Violet has a good good feeling about yeah. this one, huh? Good, good feeling like- about it. Oh, here we go. Mm. Do I win the I showcase feel- showdown if it goes? <laughs> oh, dad, come right. it. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, I keep forgetting about our audio listeners. Sorry. sorry, sorry. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh, hey, oh. hey, Kovacs, just, just uh, put it for 13. Let's, let's think about this. They've been uh, battling over the handsome lead, Seth Rogen and Ryan Reynolds. Yeah. <laughs> I'm out. I'm out. A I'm out. Oh. wins it for 13. A wins it for 13. Nice. Excellent. Right. A's got a bunch of movies, man. She's racking them up. Yeah. yeah. I got to get on the Indeed. board here. The women Do are it. taking care of business. Both have three. Taking care of business. Business. Uh oh. Oh shit. Uh-oh. Oh shit. This is the pedophile uh- movie, everybody. <laughs> oh, she's in game. <laughs> Nothing but now, now. Time traveling vortex pedophile. pedophile. <laughs> All right. This movie's gonna uh, fucking crush, man. This this is the big movie. Oh, this is here. It. Big, it's the biggest. Yeah, and I am gonna make sure. I got ideas about this about this here. Yeah, well, I'm not playing around wow. with this. Yeah, go. you want to you want to <laughs> you want to come to the party? Come, come to the party. Right. Bring it to the poll. Scott's looking too. He's thinking. Oh, why I'm oh, thinking. thinking. Uh, oh, Mike, oh. Mike went into sixty. I went into sixty-one. Bested. Sixty-one, Mike. Oh, I got a Avengers <laughs> Endgame. Yeah. We did it wow. in time. Fuck, I didn't get it in time. <laughs> Mike, just so you know, I would have gone 65 on that one. Wow. I would have rather you go on 65. Going to do 650 million easy in its sleep. Oh, yeah. In its sleep. In its sleep. Yeah, you got to go. That's probably, yeah, that's probably yeah, the good one of the whole. That's the prize of the whole thing, man. You're playing the, yeah. all your money on one. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I yeah. love how you slow played us in the beginning, Mike, and said, you know, you're not going to win at this thing if you put all your eggs in one basket <laughs> and then shapow. Yep. <laughs> it might not happen. It might not happen. See, I'm down to 19. I can't win anything I want right now unless anybody, unless nobody wants it. So. All right. Yeah. Here's your all you got, chance. You got, to, you got table scraps. I think here's your chance to, to re, you know, get a, get a big one. I honestly think this is going to do really well. Lion King. Mm-hmm. Live action shit. Yeah, it's CG, so it's not cartoon, but not really live action. I guess. Is Andy I don't know what you call it. Is oh, I don't know. Oh, because if Andy Serkis is in it, it'll do real well. Yeah. Oh, He's got I don't think star, Andy's though, right. Yeah, no. it's loaded with stars, right? Yeah, it it, it is chock full of stars. As a matter of fact, it even has some of the old the old people back in it. Uh oh, Seth Rogen back in that shit again. <laughs> Michael Key, Donald Glover, Amy Sedaris. Eh. James Earl Jones, though, dude. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, John it. Oliver. It's going to make zero money. Nobody wants to hear him talk. What? You can't see him make a face. It's true. It's a fa- scientific fact. If you can't see him make a face, people do not like his voice. Right. Oh. I don't make this what, up. It's what, science. I what, what scientific, sure what scientific journal science. studies this? Yeah. yeah, I beg to differ, uh, sir. Right. A little show called Rick and Morty. Of faces and voices. <laughs> Rick, Rick and Morty, uh, when he played the in the uh, Anatomy episode, an, mm. Anatomy Park. Come on. All right, why don't you bid sixty on it? Then? That's what you want. There you go, bid sixty yeah. on it, Mike. You do we'll that. see. You we'll see. That. 
All right, cool. maybe Start I will. Shit. Let's go. I gotta. Let's go. I gotta find it again. Where the hell did it go? <laughs> Come on. There Simba. it is. Oh no, it's the other. That's the other line. Lion King. Mm. All right. Opening bid is five from Scott. Thirty. Oh, Mike goes oh, big. Mike. For Thirty. Nice. Mm. That's too rich for oh, Mike. Violet jumps in at forty. Mm -hmm. That's good. It's gonna be a good one. That's a fair bid. 40 going once. Oh, 41. Oh, he's juicing it. Did I, I do that? Did I do that? <laughs> Did I do that? <laughs> oh, 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 five oh. from Violet. <laughs> Holy crap. All right. God, Mike, too rich for your blood, you? Mike. Come on, buddy. You got it. Oh, Violet gets nah. it 45. Nah, not with her slate. Right. She gets it with her slate. She gets it. It's all part of the game. All right. I guess that's it for me. <laughs> well, you Not got that five? much good shit left, you guys. We have five left. There Stay are around. no five hundred million dollar movies left on here. I but think we've been played. I think Peter, Peter, took us to town on the. I, I don't. I, I I beg to differ, sir. There there's there are a movies. couple of uh, there's there's some money on the board. Yeah, well, there's some money, money on the board, board, but not significant amounts of money. It's done. It's over. Beat one. It's over. Thanks, Peter. Appreciate you uh, letting us letting us play your game. Nice. <laughs> 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 All, right. All right, everybody. Here's one that could make a lot of money. It doesn't have the full cast in it, but Fast and Furious, Hobbs and Shaw. That'll make some popcorn money. Excuse oh, me. Yeah. Uh, point of order. That's yeah. the Fast and Furious Presents <laughs> Hobbs and Shaw, which means they're lending the name to a buddy cop movie, which I don't have any problem with that. I'm a big fan of the franchise. That said... Are you doing a Christopher Walken? I'm, I'm a big fan. <laughs> oh, Maybe. All right. Let's do All it. right, Hobbs and Shaw. Let's do it. It's not going to be a Tokyo Drift. No way. No. Not that good. Tokyo Drift. <laughs> All right, Mike opens for five. It's not going to be the worst movie. Is that it's what you're saying in the franchise? <laughs> oh, A. Kovacs at ah, 10. Hey. Scott Sigler at 12. Nice. My dog is having I'm, a bad dream back here. If you hear that, a Kovacs at thirteen. Hey, Ooh, I, I hear your dog whining. I think she's in pain. You should go check on her right now. <laughs> <laughs> hey, buddy. hey, buddy, it's okay. Hey, buddy. Scott wins it for That's fifteen. A steal. That's All a right. steal. That right. is a steal. Furious yeah. Seven did three hundred fifty-three million dollars. Hopefully, they I get need. That I needed you to get that movie. I know, because you want to play for the Spider-Man. That's all right. I got, got you, Got you exactly where you want me. I got you, bro. <laughs> I know. All right. Next movie. John Wick, Chapter 3, Parabellum. Mm, that's 300 mil of it. It's a cakewalk. It's a big one. Yeah, hey, Kodak, I know you like the John Wick. I What's do. That? I like to me, I was just saying, what part of the brain is the parabellum? I forget. Uh, <laughs> the part that bleeds. It's the part, with a, it's the part with a bullet in it. That's the parabellum. Right. <laughs> yeah. I love me some John Wick. And what's interesting is when you look at the numbers for John Wick, you look at the first one and you look at the second one, it's just fucking completely different set of numbers. Mm -hmm. It's it's like oh, yeah. it's not even the same franchise. John yeah. Wick is such a sleeper. Hmm. Gee. <laughs> I don't know how that's no going to work out for everybody. Come on. What do you say? Run it, Mike. Oh, shit. A's not playing around. Mm. I don't okay. know, man. Wow. I don't know if I like it. So A's at 17 now. Um, I don't know. I'm going to let her have that one. Yeah. Yeah, you, you did. <laughs> so Wait. That went quick. John. All right. Uh, that's a deal. Peter. Yes, sir. Peter, can you give us a uh, the tallies? Uh, let's see. Hold on. How many movies do we have? Are we in now? Oh, we are. You count one, two, that. Three, four, Island, so Mike has Island's got a good stretch. She's got four 12. locked up. Kovac we're about halfway there. Four. We're, we're about yeah. halfway there. So we're about 24 movies in. So uh, Mike, what are, are our standings? We're going to spending, we're gonna spend a lot of money on some shitty movies. That's what's yeah. going to happen right now. Yeah. So Mike has 81 Quatloos left. He has Shazam. Scott has 68 Quatloos. He has Cursed of My Sharona, Dark Phoenix, Fast <laughs> and Furious <laughs> presents Hobbs and Shaw. A hey, hey, Scott. Yeah. yeah. I'm really, uh, I'm really banking on that long tail for Shazam. That's what I'm really banking <laughs> <Right>. on. <laughs> right. 
Uh, a Kovacs has 19 left, but she has Pet Cemetery, Long Shot, Detective Pikachu, and John Wick. Uh, I have 19 left because I blew my load on Avengers Endgame. <laughs> <laughs> and I got lucky with the Toy Story four, I think. Yeah, uh, you know. Yeah, you got it. It's over, you guys. It's already over. Yeah. Peter's won it. Yeah. Lo Violet has five left, and she has the Hustle, A Dog's Journey, Secret Life of Pets two, which is going to be good for you, I think. I think it's going to make a lot of money. Yeah. I think Lion King's going to yeah. make a lot of money too. Yeah. All right, Mike. Next movie. Yesterday, I don't think it's going to make shit for money, but I so want to see. Yeah. It. Yeah. It really looks good too. Yeah, I, really I don't want to watch this. a karaoke Beatles movie, you guys. I don't want to watch it. <laughs> I just, what are you I'm, I'm a sucker. Yeah, you're right, Scott. Name one movie where just a montage of music and and histories of artists, is, it, you know, did good. Name one movie. It's about one. a guy pretending to write the Beatles songs. Come on, bro. He's not pretending. <laughs> he he knows he's cold fronting doing that. I'm, I'm but nobody also, knows. It's also a time travel movie, and that's never good. I'm a is it a time travel movie? Yes, it's an alternate history time travel karaoke movie subgenre. <laughs> I, I would say I'll give you. It's, I'll give it's you karaoke time... punk. Yeah, karaoke <laughs> punk. <laughs> I'll give you alt history for sure. I don't know if I can give you time travel on that one. All right, come on. Mike. Come on. Uh, okay, well, we'll we'll talk about this yesterday. Yeah. Talk about I mean, after I drop five on it. Oh, Scott goes to six. Uh, to push my big pile. This could be the sleeper nah. hit. Or, or it could be. Oh, a Kovacs goes 15. Oh, or it could be the sleeper sure. shit. Yeah. <laughs> let's, let's hope it's sleeper shit. Because <laughs> Kate, because uh, A gets it for 15. Yeah. Well, I didn't realize it was, a, it was a, a Danny Boyle movie. And those historically yeah. do well. Train Spotting did great. 28 Days Later did great. Shallow Grave is one of my favorite movies. So I figured, why not? Sunshine, right? Did he do that? You he guys. Did, did he? Sunshine. Did Slum 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 Dog Millionaire. Dog Millionaire. Mm -hmm. right. is like, AK is like the Jason Blum of this game. She's just racking up B movies. Right. <laughs> big all of them. I, I did why that one that? year. Hey, you know where it got me? Bupkis, did a, it get you nowhere? A solid third place. Got me so, a solid, solid third. I, I, I'm really? all right with third place. That's not fourth <laughs> place. All right, fifth place. All right. Uh, next as long minute. as I'm not fifth place, I think it'll Let's be good. Yeah. Sixth, sixth. Who, who, Jason. If I'm not, if I'm behind Jason, it won't be good. <laughs> yeah, so, right. <laughs> <laughs> so this one, this one, I I have no, I, I don't know. Dumbo. I have no idea how this is going to yeah. go. Oh, I do. I. Yeah, I don't think it's going to do well because people remember – don't you cry at that movie? Yeah, I don't right. think people are going to volunteer and, and, for that. Yeah, when they put a bullet in his parabellum, you cry all day long. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, uh, wait, as, you, as, as you guys are bidding on this, I want you to think about being at that circus with Dumbo flying over your head. Mm -hmm. And Ed, just as he's flying over there, I want you to imagine <laughs> he right. takes a huge crap <laughs> right on your head. Right. All right. Oh, do Why we do you gotta be oh, like that, Nick? Okay. Why do you gotta be like that? This was the examples I had to let me erase those. All right. Oh, okay. oh, I was All gonna right. say I didn't remember. Yeah. Keep bidding. Yeah, keep bidding. Right. Clear out the bit. Okay. All right. Until eight. All right. So, so Violet goes for five. Scott goes for eight. Turn this on. Mike Cave is going for ten. Oh. Scott goes eleven. Him like 11. Hmm, I'm feeling Him like 13 like is where I'm going to stop. Nice, nice. I'm definitely feel. Oh, Scott, All Scott you. Yeah. You. I'm not going any higher than, than uh, say, I don't know, 15. Oh, I'm not, oh, I'm not going any higher. I'm not doing it. I'm oh, not doing Scott's it. 16. Yo, we're not. talking about Dumbo. Dumbo, uh, right? I mean, it's a big right. property. It could do. Oh, Scott, oh I missed it. I missed my sniper. I had sniper. to get something. I had to get me some elephant titus. Actually, some elephant parabellum. I will, I will not be surprised one bit if that movie does really well. I just don't know. It looks like some of the scenes I saw were like kind of uncanny valley a little bit, like kind of creepy. Yeah. I think it's. I think I made a horrible mistake. Can okay. I have that money back? <laughs> yeah, yeah. We'll do that after the, after the draft. We'll. Uh, I'll, I'll uh, send that back to you. Okay. Oh, here's one. Now, Mike, here's you know, one. Here, here's a movie. You know, 
I'm going to yeah, not I like know. this movie just because I am not oh. a Will Smith fan. Hate me if you want. I can't I don't care. I don't care. Will Smith, man. Aladdin. Oh, Aladdin. Yeah, there's some pretty big shoes to fill. Yeah. And I'm not a Will Smith fan. Don't like right. anything he's done. Well, Except for, well, you know Fresh what? Prince. Except for Fresh Prince. I'm across on the internet, not very positive. People made fun of the special effects. And has Will Smith's summer mojo peaked and gone away? No, you're wrong. People have now have gotten used to it since the the time when people had a little uh, problem with it. Now everyone's kind of receptive to it after they've had a chance to warm up to it. That it? said, no, I don't. I don't think so. I'm I'm wrong. <laughs> You're just trying to get people to bid on it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> or not bid on it. Yeah. All right, Mike. Violet opens with five. Sigler six. Mike with Mike. seventeen. Oh, seventeen. Wow. wow. Spice in the pot. Yay. Mike is all, I want Shazam, Avengers, <laughs> Dumbo, and Aladdin. Yeah. I want all the kiddies. <laughs> yeah, that's a system. Mike gets it. He's got the Dumbo. Uh, I really thought I was going to draw sorry, someone Aladdin. over, but Aladdin. that's okay. That's all right. You know, I, I have a good feeling about Aladdin. It, you know, I, um, I just I just saw estimates for that from 65 to 240 million. You may have crawled back into this. Dude. Hey. You may have. Two, yeah, there you go. 200 million. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Could be anywhere from zero to for infinity. I would like to point uh, out that After Earth made negative $10. So there's your last little <laughs> message. Yes, it did. It's so bad. You know, I didn't even see it. I was like, I don't think I could sit through this. Wow. All right. Hey, and anybody in this chat room, I, people are chatting like crazy. They are going nuts. Good. I don't see anybody. I'm in the group chat. What are you talking about? What chat oh, room? Right. Yeah, on are Facebook. You? Go to Facebook. If you go to Facebook Live, uh, though, then yeah. the sound will be on. Sorry, Sorry everybody. Facebook.com slash Mythwit? Yeah. You'll yes. see the video there. And it's, oh, it's and funny. then you got to log into this shit. Okay. Yeah, All right, sorry, people. Sorry, buddy. sorry, buddy. Prepare for the chat room to be violated. Hold on a oh, second. Oh, God. All right. While he's Good. chatting, let's, let's do... Uh, yeah. Good. Right. Hurry up, Pete. Let's right, get yeah. this started. <laughs> well, right, while, right. It's, while it's distracted. So so here we go. Rocket Man. Rocket what the fuck Man. is that about? I you know, I've been reading about, about this. It's, it's the, not uh, one of those. Oh, it's go ahead. Elton John. It's Bohemian Rhapsody, but with Elton John. That's right. what they're oh, yeah. trying yeah, to do. That's all around. mine. Forget about it. No, name yeah. one movie. Name one movie that did well like that. <laughs> it's, it's <laughs> Elton Rhapsody. Crap. Nobody <laughs> wants to go to the movies and hear old music. That's what right. I heard. <laughs> You're old. You're I old am. music. <laughs> you are. That's right. All right. I don't like this. Oh, shit. We're bidding. Oh, crap. Um, <laughs> oh, shit. Really? No. Oh, damn Mike. it. Um, no, 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 It would be <laughs> befitting for me to get that. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I jumped oh. it to 11. Step it up. Step it in. Let oh, him begin. Mike's at 13. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Mike's got to get on the board, buddy. Uh, uh oh! Whoa! What happened? Draft Raptor just oh, oh. crashed. Yeah, it'll no, it's not crashing. It'll be back. Just give it a second. Okay. All right. Right in the middle of a it'll, bid. Uh, Come on now. Yeah. So yeah, is anybody going to bid for that anyway? Other than Mike, I, 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 was anyone going to go higher than me? Because I wasn't. Doesn't matter. I, it doesn't matter. If they were going to go higher, they should have gone higher from square one. You can't That's control right. what happens with the referees, you guys. You can't control the bad call or the bum rebound. If you don't want it to be a close game, do better before it happens. Got it. Shazam. Rocket Man. Shazam. Outspoken. Mike has Rocket Man. Okay. <laughs> Coach Sigler speaks. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Next movie. Next movie. Gojira. Oh, that's my shit. Men yeah. in, nope, oh. Men in Black nope. International. No. Men in Tights. Men in, men in Black. But it isn't... I got a bad feeling about this, you guys. I got a bad it, feeling. It, it, what, what's that. wrong? What's wrong, Han? I, I just don't think it's going to do very well. I think it, uh, I think the Men in Black franchise is over. I don't think millennials even remember that shit. They I have never really watched the original it. movies. So, I don't know. I don't know. And they bring in a I new feel people. Like this is smack talk. Yeah. Yeah. I kind of do too. I mean, <laughs> I mean, he's going to go in well, all big on the Men in Black International. Yeah. All right. Let's do I'll this. I'll throw a nickel. I'll throw in a nickel. Ah, yeah. Oh, well, you're going to have to throw in more. For 10. Yeah. 
I knew it. I knew it. He wanted it. I knew it. Go ahead, Mike. Bid on Men in Black, Mike. Bid on Men in Black and not be there for Spider Man, Mike. Come on, baby. Let's do it. Nope. Nope. What's up? What's up? Scott's got Men in Black. It's all you, buddy. There we go. Scott, I think think that's not a bad buy. For 11? Well, there's nothing fucking left. I held on all my money. So there you go. (laughs) You just got miked. (laughs) All right. All right, here's a big boy. Let's see who's got the most money. Mike Mike, Mike. You're gonna have to spend all of it. Hey, send that motherfucker to the bank with this one. Spider Man Far From Home. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. I think I it's know. gonna be I a just... hard act to follow after um yeah. Spider Verse. Uh, exactly. Yeah. I don't think it's gonna yeah. do well. Is yeah. this an animated flick? Spider Man Power From no, Home? No, it's live action. It's live no, action. No. And okay. it, it's it's, it's got like uh, Spider Man's European vacation. Yep. My That's daughter. a horrible pitch line. Violet, when I start a movie studio, you can write movies, but you can never pitch movies. No, never. that's what I'm saying. It's Spider-Man's European vacation, as in like National Lampoons. I'm mocking the idea of it. Nobody I nobody should bid anything on this. No. I, no, I'm no, not. no one. Nobody I'm not. Bid. I'm I'm bidding negative. Where's my negative? Yeah. All right. Let's do it. Hmm. I don't have enough mm. money to play in this stream, so I'm not even going to try. <laughs> but Scott, I if you go th- for six. If you think you're getting it for six bucks, <laughs> you're oh, fucking Scott's crazy. 121. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Welcome to the party, 30. pal. Oh, is that right, Mike? Yeah, Mike's yeah. 30. Oh, shit. Scott's oh. 31. No, Make him spend it all, that Scott. Oh, come Mike's on. Mike, you got more money than that, dog. Scott's at 33. Oh. Brother, keep come going, on, now. Keep going. Take it <laughs> Oh! Mike keeps at 40. Oh, shit. What's left? There's not very much left, is there? Hmm. Oh, there's Hellboy. There's Hellboy. You know you want Hellboy. Oh, oh, oh you bastard. <laughs> Make him spend it, Scott. Make him spend it. He wants Scott, this one. Scott, you know you want Hellboy. He wants this no, one, I Scott. Don't. I know how that's going to do. Oh, oh, Scott damn. got far from home. Dude, you got it. goodbye. 350 million. That's what's going to happen. Oh, yeah. I don't like Spider-Man anymore, but it makes a lot of money. Stop rebooting it. That's my song for you. I got fucked up, man. It wouldn't take my 42, and I'm really pissed. Mm-hmm. I'm, uh-huh. I'm, I'm, I'm calling Fix, but I'm the one who's running it. So <laughs> I'm, uh... You're running the fucking board, so <laughs> you've got no one to blame but you. All right. All right. Uh, well, well, well like guess a... what? That's... I own all these movies next. They're all mine. <laughs> right. That's like Charles Barkley saying that he was misquoted in his autobiography. That's what? <laughs> yeah, that was what he, he complained about. Uh, his autobi- no, I, I was misquoted. I was- all right, we're down to five movies, all of which Mike could own. All right, Mike, Hellboy. Oh, Scott, this one's for you, buddy. I'm getting this one for you. Dude, I tell you what, this is it. I'm not going to, I'm out. I don't think this is going to make a lot of money. I'm not going to lie to you. Mike, don't bid on it. Don't do it. Mike, don't bid on it. Mike, don't bid on it. I did. I only have 19. Oh, oh I, come on, Mike! I told you not to bid on that shit. I, you, you know what? You are not. You are not defeating me like that. Peter, Somebody's gonna go down. Oh, oh, yes, nineteen, bitch. Uh-huh. I'm all in. Mike, get it for twenty. You know, no way. Look, what, what? You can't bid, Mike. There's no one left. What are you? Oh, you silly man. There's nothing left. Yeah, Who nothing cares? Left. What is Pete going to do? Win with a little bit more, like 30 million more? <laughs> I, was looking at, I was looking at what I had left, what's left on the board, and what I have left. I'm like, fuck it. I want this one. I'll take it. Right. <laughs> I, like, I like Hellboy. Yeah. Yeah. Plus, have uh, $30 million on us. <laughs> <laughs> I got three movies. I only have to put my score in three times. All right. So we're down to just a few here. A few movies for Mike. Uh, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> Child's Play is the next movie. Mike, oh, you better hope you better hope Godzilla is the best monster movie ever, which means we'll make one hundred and twenty seven million dollars. Although I, I will know. say I was looking at this child's play. It's directed by a Norwegian horror director. And the trailer actually I was impressed by the cinematography. Yeah, so we, who knows? We know what that you means. Don't, you don't go to child's play for cinematography. You go for crappy humor. And a doll you go. You you may not you may not go there, but you certainly enjoy it. It's like you don't go to Olive Garden for the you know endless breadsticks or whatever, but you sure uh, enjoy I them don't. while you're there. So no, shit, I don't. <laughs> endless yeah. breadsticks all day, dog. All day and a little bit of salad. 
<laughs> oh, for fuck's <laughs> sake. All right, listen, let me just... Uh... Child's play. Christ. Come on, Mike. Five. Oh, hey, Kovacs goes in for four. Violet's yeah. going all in. Five. Gee, I guess I get it Mike. for six. <laughs> <laughs> no, you know what? I want it for seven. <laughs> yeah, it, it's not and this if, game if you don't outbid yourself at least once. Yeah, and if you don't think this is the first time I've outbid myself, you are right. <laughs> I like that you're gets proud. It for seven. I like that you're proud of the bad math. Own that <laughs> shit. Own it. All right. All right. Oh my god, this is silly. All right. Godzilla, King Godzilla. of the So Mike will get this one for six. <laughs> so can I ask this is why, why do they still keep making these movies? Because they make money. They make, they're making about 100% profit on them. I, to, from my point of view, the, the Godzilla, I don't know what, terrible. the dramatic possibilities of a Godzilla have been exhausted. It was, you know what, because Godzilla is not about dramatic possibilities. It's about watching the giant lizard fight shit. Yeah. That's it. That's fine. That's all there is to it. And that's all anybody wants. I'm going to be there opening night. To on the yes, giant but have, but, but have you seen Hedrick Imsen's Godzilla performed on the Norwegian stage? It is. It is oh. I, 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 have not been, I have not been to Norwegia to watch a Godzilla yeah. stage. <laughs> Norwegia. Yeah. Norwegian. Yeah, no idea. Great. So, <laughs> look, I'm gonna be there because Millie Bobby Brown is in it, and my daughter has a girl crush on Millie Bobby Brown. She is one of the biggest Stranger Things fans you will ever, ever, ever find. Which one is she? What's that? Bobby Millie Brown's Bobby Brown. She's eleven. Which no, which which one from Stranger Things? Which character is she? She's oh, she's 11. eleven. She. She's the girl with the oh, okay. and stuff. Hey, uh, Pete, okay. Pete, I have an Got idea. It. Why don't you just draw the next uh, thing so I can bid my six bucks and win, okay? Right. <laughs> right. I did, Godzilla. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> so you get Godzilla for six, because no one's going to let you have it for less than six. Well, I appreciate that, everyone. <laughs> it's good. Huh? Well, oh, well, that is? Godzilla, dude. Oh, you did? Oh yeah, we already ran Godzilla. Where, what what, what are you doing, man? Next oh, shit, movie, I don't please. Know. I'm behind the fuck. I'm behind the curve here. Sorry, sorry, buddy. Sorry, buddy. Uh, Ugly dolls. This is bad marketing. I don't know what this is, but it looks. Oh like well, it's what you don't know is it, it's it's going to be the uh, sleeper uh, <laughs> an, animation movie of the year, right. and and you get it for six. Oh, Look at that. Yeah, yeah that <laughs> All I hope, all I hope is this is the highest grossing Fast and Furious movie ever, and it's gonna make four hundred million, and I'm gonna laugh and laugh and laugh. Well, Scott, you got a ton of fucking movies in there. You never know. You got the Fast and Furious, you got Spider Man, you got Men in Black, Dark Phoenix. Everybody's all... fighting for second place. You got and... Toy Story, yeah. and you got Avengers Endgame. It's over. That's... Yeah. Hey, yeah. listen. Second place is first for last place. Okay, bro. All right. Hey. <laughs> So, so this next one is Shaft, but I got to read you hey. the tagline that's on the poster. Shut it's, your mouth. No, the tagline <laughs> on the poster is, I swear to God, this is on their poster, more Shaft than you can handle. <laughs> <laughs> it's awesome. <All> right. <laughs> so let that go for... Going in for five. Hmm. It's a BBM. I'm it's a big black movie. It's going to be great. The first I, I'm in, only man. going for five. That's all I want this one for. All right. All right. There you go. I can't there believe you I am going to beat you guys wow. with 82, 80, uh, what do I got? 80, you got 8,000 yeah. 8, fucking movies. 84 <laughs> points to spare. I am going to beat this draft with $84 in my pocket. I'll take you all to you the got movie. Right. You got $26. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 26. Yeah. I spent 84. <laughs> Yeah. I spent with, with with only also, spending that adds up to those math skills that really came to the forefront. Yeah. I did the mathematician. Spend. I did the mathematician, right. but reversed. Okay. I, I right. would like to point out he did outbid himself just a yes. little while. Right. Ago. Yeah. That, that was surprising. that was only to put myself in in my place. Okay. Yes. Right. You don't know. I get cocky. I'm, I, get I got cocky. some. I got some ten poles up in this bitch, but I'll be lucky to get second place. Right. So, hey, so we, we went through this whole thing. Dude, we did it in less than an hour. I can't believe it. I can't Impressive. believe we did it in less than an hour. That's amazing. It's, it's the draft rafter, man. This thing is yeah. beautiful. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. When it works, it. when it gives me Spider-Man. <laughs> Spider-Man. <laughs> All right. Um, so let, let's do this. So we have our guests on. Let's give a few seconds here. Uh, Violet, where can people yes. find you and your wonderful books? 
Uh, right now, you can come see me if you're in the Portland area. I'm going to be at AWP, the biggest uh, writers and publishers conference. It moves every year. This year, it's in Portland. And I'll be there with my small press, uh, Kingshot Press, a fantastic group of people, and all the other authors that they represent. So come on out. And then at some point, we're also going to be going to Stripperoke, which is karaoke while you're on the stage with strippers. So I've not done this before. This will be interesting. You get, It'll be kara get, karaoke what? punk. Do you get to strip while you're karaoke? I guess I guess if you do, nobody will stop you, but it's not okay. required. So it's not required, right? Wow. <laughs> yeah. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. When, when I'm confused. <laughs> is it hot in here? When is this? <laughs> where, where, where is it? What? AWP. It, yeah. it, that's I'm leaving. What is it? I'm going to be there from like the 28th to the first but then i think stripperoki is at a it's not at the conference it's somewhere else but the people i'm staying with said you gotta come to stripperoki with us and i said fine all right it's, apparently it's a portland thing like it's pretty uh, it's right, like there's right. also in portland there's also a vegan unionized strip club which i have not visited as well but that's portland so wow yeah the vegans are unionized yes no, only the vegan like, strippers. Like Let's tip. not judge everyone, okay? Let's not judge everyone. It's the vegan strippers are unionized. It's where it starts. It starts with the strippers, right. and then it goes right. out. Next thing you know, the vegan, <laughs> oh, the vegan yeah. truck drivers. Right. And... You're right. The union. Yep. Yep. <laughs> That's part of the communist manifesto. If we right. start with the stripper, <laughs> right. we will move on. Right. Right. I'm gonna draw the line at at vegan meat packers, okay? That's right. hey, hey, <laughs> just the line there. Right. They're, just, they're not unionized. That's just straight right. up fucking silly. That's right. just silly. They're just confused. <laughs> right. Oh god. All right, Scott or A, either one. Which uh, who wants to go first? Go ahead, A. Go ahead. Uh, uh, you can find us at scottsigler.com or emptyset.com. There is a Facebook group uh, for Scott's, uh, I guess, author author persona which is facebook.com slash scott sigler and then there's also a junkies group the sigler junkies is a closed group on facebook you'll probably find everything you need to know about us there please join that group because we'll i'm sure we'll be having a lot of fun over the next couple of months in that group talking about this ridiculousness that we've just been mm -hmm. a part of mm -hmm. um also a can you please talk about uh story smack please let everyone know uh, uh, yeah, along, along with the books that are done yeah oh i wonder if we'll probably cover some of these at least one of these movies this summer on story smack so we run yeah. a um a podcast uh roughly every other week which is about stories and storytellers in the world of pop culture and um we have on april 1st we have a new book in the gfl series uh going up for pre-order and that's at that's just scott sigler.com right scott yep that's mm -hmm. right april 1st 9 a.m pacific time it's the sixth book out of eight books in the series and uh and it'll go on sale that morning so we, 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 we don't have a name yet. Is that is that, is that what it's you're the saying? Gangster. It's the gangster. The gangster. Okay, and, that's yeah. right. And look, I'll tell you. So I'm wearing, I don't know if you noticed. Go Kraken, I did. I represent right. the Krakens tonight. Um, I am not a football person. I do not do the sports ball, okay? And I love the GFL series. I love it. It's awesome. And I don't, I know more about football now than I ever knew. Even like, I, I knew this much. Now I know this much. You know yeah. nothing about football, yeah. Peter. I, know. I will say we we get a, a probably once a week we get an email where where someone says I didn't really want to read the football books because I don't really like football, but there was nothing else to read, so I no more Scott Sigler books to read, so I read yep. and I love them and they're my favorite book. We get that a lot, yep. and we get I don't really like football. I still don't really like football, but now my father-in-law likes me better on Thanksgiving Day. <laughs> we get a lot of that too. And, and you know what the the the, the stories, uh, Scott, since you kind of rebrand them a little bit more, you did a little bit of, of, of refining on them and made them more of a, a, a YA storyline. Yeah. Um, the, the first story, the, the rookie, is it's an excellent tale about somebody overcoming prejudice. And it's it's actually that is really, really cool. I, I would never have thought that a football book with gangsters and sports base pirates and shit would do that but i was like but it did it was very good we we get into a lot of stuff in the series we get into uh prejudice and one thing i think is sorely lacking in our current cultural conversation which is people who are prejudiced who've been raised in an environment where they simply don't know any better everyone around them their authority figures parents friends etc are from a culture where they're raised 
to be judgmental of others and they don't even realize it. And when people like that, that's a culture I grew up in, when you get out of there and you join the bigger world, which is the metaphor for Quentin Barnes, the main character, has to leave his parochial all human system and go join the bigger system with the other races if he wants to be the best it's ever been. Uh, he learns a lot. You learn a lot about, you don't know that everyone is a lot like you because they all seem so different from you. So that's what we get into a lot in the series. But uh, just a quick shout out, uh, Paul Cooley, Spike, and Tim still watching this. <laughs> the only people watching the Facebook Live. What nice. I have to say is, watch out for Pinhead. That's all I oh. have to say. That oh, does dear. not look like a very threatening pinhead. I, I can't lie. He's, he's that's kind why, of, you know what? like the pufferfish no, version of pinhead. That's why he's a real, real pinhead. Right. You're going to like, oh, he's so cute. I love him. I want to take him home. And then he shows you his pinhead butt. And things get crazy. Yeah. yeah. Nice. nice. All right. Nice. So did Scott, did you have anything else you wanted to say? We're finishing up our free podcast novel, Earth Core, right now, which is at episode 40. It ends at 41. It is unabridged. It, you can find that at scottsigrow.com slash subscribe. We're on Spotify, we're on iTunes, we're on iHeart Music, we're on all of the big ones. And every week I give away about 30 or 40 minutes of unabridged serial fiction for free. And I've been doing that for closing in on 15 years now. So if you like the sound of, uh, of what I do, you can go get it for free. And don't even cost you nothing. Then you'll give me all your money later because that's how we do it. And then I did. I then I get the audiobook. I'm, I'm I get like you know ten or twelve episodes into Earthcore, and I'm like I can't wait. So then I go and I listen to the whole thing, and then I'm like oh, I, I can't. I don't listen week to week because it's just a little weird. And can't, mm -hmm. so, but then I I miss hearing your voice every week. Well, I uh, you know what? How can you not miss this voice? It's it's quite lovely. It's quite lovely. <laughs> it's, it's velvety. It is. <laughs> you know I miss I miss. From when you when Nocturnal was reread and and I, what's it Phil Gigante right he he did that mm -hmm. uh, and yeah. he did a fantastic job but God damn it I miss Mr. Biznass that is my favorite character that you've ever done uh, mm -hmm. he is fucking hilarious. But, well, we're know. gonna get him back someday. Uh, a, will be, a will be mad at me for saying this, but there will be eventually some kind of Nocturnal sequel somewhere. Oh. I just don't know when I'm gonna get it done, but it's gonna be great. Right. It's not <laughs> a real big surprise. <laughs> The biggest yeah, book I'm looking forward to is is the sequel is the second book of the crypt. That is my I cannot fucking wait. I know it's coming. Yeah. I know when I'm a patient boy, but I that well, when you that know one what? comes out. Peter, that's oh. actually true of Scott as well. That's the thing he wants more than everything else. <laughs> Except I'm like, but if you finish this, this stuff, you'll be done forever. And the crypt could go on forever. So I think that'll be he'll he'll get to writing that next year, I'm pretty sure. Nice. You know, somebody posted uh, on the Sigler Junkies um, just yesterday, I think it was, if you could be a character in the Sigler verse, what would you be and how would you die? And, you know, for Peter and I, it was easy. I was like, oh, I've already died. I died on the Washington, D.C. <laughs> I freaked out, man. I freaked out. I got crushed by a giant piece of copper, I think. Yeah. Like a copper asteroid. So. All right. Well, we won't keep you all any longer. Thank you so much for joining Thank us. Thank you, the everybody. I Thank will be you posting links throughout the summer. I'll do updates. I'll try and do them yes. every couple of weeks. Uh, I have a chart of a fancy dancy chart that I do in Excel, which shows the tracking and all that. Yep. Right. Um, and then I, you know, and I do a funny little bit where I try and make, you know, play off names of movies that are coming up and stuff like Wait. that. Uh, and and I'll what? give everybody's links. When do we get to come over and roll around naked in a pile of paper quat loose? Uh, that September, September. All right, <laughs> but, all right. A uh, Violet, uh, can hey. we do? Can we do stripper karaoke when we come over and roll around? Absolutely, it's done. It's done. All yeah, right. <laughs> I'm in. I'm in, dog. This right. is great. <laughs> Excuse me, who has Quatlu's left? This, this guy. This guy. I have <laughs> exactly. exactly. So wait a minute. Does that mean that we all have to strip and you throw Quatlu's at us? I right. mean, if the shoe fits, buddy, right. wear it. Nice. I think it's going to take me more than 23 quat lose to persuade me to do that. <laughs> hey, man. I think yeah. you're going to want to keep your quat lose for me. So, right. <laughs> All right. Let's, let's quat close lose, this. Quat lose. Quat lose. Everybody good. Yeah. Right. All right. All right. Let's close this thing out. All right. Uh, okay. wait a minute. Let, me get my, let me get my notes here. And then I'll do the closer. All right. 
you've just enjoyed another awesome episode of the Mythwits. If you don't have time for videos, make sure to subscribe to our pad, pod, my pa our podcast. What am I fucking new? Uh, what is it? Uh, Boston <laughs> podcast via your favorite Take podcast. Two. Yeah, right. Do the like, follow, subscribe thing wherever it's appropriate, and make sure to share your favorite episode on social media and help spread Mythwits love over the entire planet. Only read this like a thousand times, Mike. Tweet us at <laughs> Mythwits. <laughs> And uh, check out Mythwits.com. Mythwits is produced by Aether Forge Creations as part of the TSR Podcast Network. Jason, we missed you tonight. It's a shame. Would have been awesome. But uh, TSR is our is our parent company. Uh, check out TSRPN.com and AetherForge.com for more cool stuff. Mythwits is a Creative Commons product. Like and share it in all the places. Just don't edit it. Don't sell it. And don't trade it in for your quat lose. Thanks, everybody, <laughs> for listening. Tell your friends to tune in. And until next week... Mike? That's all, folks.